part three and uh, gathering information to get the kids back on health care. I'm stumbling over toys there. But today I was expecting to get the application. Um, if you remember, I called them earlier this week. I figured by today I would get the information that I need from them to start that process. Yesterday we can add ten minutes to the total time because I stopped by my work to talk to my main boss man to get me the payroll information that I need to give them. This is the closet of doom. And here's Violet. Hi, Violet. Oh, she's smiling. She's saying there's so many things in here for me to look at. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay, I can't pull that stuff though because it'll fall down on us, okay? Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. I didn't even know what this was all supposed to be out there, but Ian, rightfully so, put it away. It looks nicer. And I should have an envelope this with Mom our last attempt, too. Oh, look at that. There's the ice pack for Daddy's boo-boo. See that ice pack? That's cool. Maybe I'll find some of my underwear in here. Those aren't mine. Those are fine. Look at those. are cute. Those are huge, though. <laughs> mine. They are yours. <laughs> Go for it. Huge bloomers. Um, this is probably why. Um... Uh, I don't know. I'm behind on a lot of stuff. And our very important papers, our VIPs, should be in this closet. Damn, I'm just trying to think. I'm wandering here. Um, where the heck did I put them last time? They were in a big envelope. Big envelope, Violet. This is a whole bunch of pay stubs. But I'm talking about birth certificates, wedding certificates, titles to which car is this one? Oh, let's see. Let's see. Oh, this is for the Dodge Diplomat, I think. Um, okay. I always walk through memory lane in this closet, Ooh, huh? Open. Oh, you found candy in here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm um, the Oh, there's the total woman book that you want to open. <laughs> you open the Smarties? Zingy. All right, it's the one that's packaged. Zingy. They're zingy. Oh, no, these aren't the zingy ones. The sour ones. Oh. No, open. Can you take this and sit over there? That way I don't bump you and knock them all over the place. Thank you, love. No. All right. Anyways, this book is awesome. Um, I could just read a little bit of it to you. Oh, here's the Schwab stuff that I was using. Write down the things that you have to do tomorrow. He said, Schwab wrote. Now number these items in the order of their real importance. Lee continued, and Schwab did it. The first thing, tomorrow morning, we instructed, start working on number one and stay with it until it's completed. Next, take number two. And don't go any further until it's completed. Then proceed to number three. Okay, well, we're getting off off topic here. Um, what's that? Funny money. This is one of the budget. The <laughs> 2640 plan. <laughs> um, from last July. My budget. <laughs> 2640, I don't know. I might have been drinking. Um, schoolwork. We are not finding this, so. But there's, oh, we found Sonic's cover. Yeah. Oh, I'll dig that. Oh, I don't want any Smarties. No, thank you. That was very nice of you to share that. Okay, here's one of the bags that Ian has collected. That's a good book, too. Oh, shoot. You know what I'm seeing right now? I'm seeing photocopies of our very important papers. Alright. Let's see. 
I'm going to have to dig a little bit. So, um, I'm timing this. And this isn't really anyone's fault but my own, letting things get disastrous. All right. Shoo! I thought I was missing all of our originals, like driver's license, passports, uh, social security cards, medical cards. <sighs> I was just in the wrong place. Um, so I've got everything like that. I actually have, I was smart last time and I made extra photocopies. So um, I don't know if I have enough, so I'm going to count them. And um, we're looking at 15 minutes so far of today and that plus the 10 minutes, so we're 25 minutes plus 19. Well, we'll, we'll get that added up in a little bit. Um, I'm going to just look through. Of course, I'm not going to show you my personal information because this is the Internet, after all, and we can't trust anyone anymore. Which reminds me, um, we actually, I had this sudden urge to go and check out the Megan's Law information for our area, and we have some preverts in our neighborhood. Um, the thing with that is that you really don't know what they did. They don't reveal any of their crimes, so they it could be anything from being 18 years old and having sex with a 17-year-old to, like, horrific, horrible crimes. So, I don't know. I was trying to think of, um, you know, anyone that I see on a daily basis, but no one looked very familiar, so that's probably good. Because it would be very uncomfortable to sell a pack of smokes to a, um, you know, a sex offender. I mean, I probably do it all the time. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, all right. The tally is 15 minutes, and I have a pizza cooking because I'm starving. And I'm gonna see this, and then we'll see some photocopying. Oh yeah. Interesting stuff. I know it. <laughs>